as it is used in the passage the phrase stiff verbal minuet refers to the interaction between george washington and thompson as washington a writes a letter to langdon the president pro tempore b excuses himself from thompson so he may say goodbye to his wife martha c is officially told that he has been elected president of united states and accepts the position or d formally resigns from his position as commander in chief of the army and re- and appoints a replacement okay the word minuet over here means a sort of ballroom dance so when they say verbal minuet they are talking about a kind of dance that happens between the two of them in their words so it's a phrase it doesn't actually refer to any literal dancing but merely a back and forth of words so over here we see in the passage um conducted a stiff minuet each man reading from a prepared statement so there was a two or fro happening between them as both of them were reading one by one the statements that they had already prepared so thompson's statement basically told him told washington that he was becoming the president of united states of america and uh, washington on the other hand accepted it see he acknowledges his uh, election in a short self efficiating fsa speech of disclaimers so um we see that the verbal minuet the to and fro that happened was about thompson telling him that he has been accepted as the pri- president and washington accepting this election so hence we choose option option c